Welcome back, guys, to Pokemon Legends Arceus. Well, last episode, after delivering a big enough boizel, we set out to the Crimson Mylands to explore our second locale, catching a few Pokemon on the way to the Selassian Ruins, where we met Warden Calaba of the Pearl Clan, who dismissed us after a few sentences, not wanting our aid, with Volo appearing to battle us once again. After the fight, the merchant asked us to find the fragment of the wall stolen from the room, giving us a tip as to where the bandits may be, as we set out to confront the trio known as Miss Fortune, Coin, Charm, and Clover, reclaiming the fragment, which we now return to Calaba. Let's go, weird here. Gotta move you carefully, just in case I randomly jump into the middle of nowhere. Thank you, earlier, for the gifted sub yet again, Viet. The nominous. We saw it our time here very fast. Hey, Volo. Good work. Very good indeed, <laughs> Alessandria. Why, thank you. You got the fragment back safe and sound. I'm well aware of Calaba's reputation. They say she's stubborn, too old fashioned, and so on. But she's given the poor clad all she has ever since she was young. She lived her prime years here in the Hisui region. Trusting in the guidance of Almighty Sinner. I don't think it's that she hates the Diamond Clan or the Galaxy team. Rather, I think she simply loves the Pearl Clan very, very much. Anyway, I do hope you're able to calm Ursaluna's frenzy, Alessandria. A raging Pokemon in the area definitely isn't good for business, I assure you. But I'm assuming her Bibarel is what she's going to use. So, Luxio, I choose you. Something tells me she's not going to appreciate our help. Oh, so you've come to bother me again. Well, come as often as you like, but it won't change my mind. So, this wall fragment here. What, you went and retrieved the fragment from those bandits? Why go out of your way like that for a complete stranger like me? I guess you're that eager to calm Ursa Luna, hmm. I mean, Arezu did ask. Yeah, if possible. I'll admit, I didn't expect anybody else to truly care for Ursa Luna. Well then, let's see that wall fragment. And there we go, good as new. Oh, unknown language. Oh. All lives. Did, didn't we re We read this in Pokemon Brilliant <laughs> All lives. Is that a T? T O W? No. It's like a bit. Ah, yeah. Touch other lives to. All lives touch other lives too. I definitely read this. <laughs> Create something. There we go. Don't worry. I got there in the end. A new. Create something new and alive. A new and alive. Let me read what it says. Oh, you're going to read it anyway. <laughs> I just. <laughs> Look, I spent all that time translating. Don't be mean. All lives touch other lives. Create something new and alive. I see. I suppose it means people helping each other, like how you helped retrieve the fragment. I've read this passage many, many times, but this is the first time I've truly understood what it means. Maybe this is Almighty Sinnoh's guidance. What is your name then, girl? And I put it in unknown, you know, text so you can read it slowly like I did. Except you seem to be able to read it fine. I see. Odysandria, please lend me your strength so that we may help Ursa Luna. It's true that Ursaluna has become enraged, but he doesn't seem to be in an utter frenzy. I think he will return to his normal state if we can just give him some medicine. I could never bring myself to engage Pokemon in battle. That's something I can rely on you for, am I right? Ursaluna prefers to stay on Sludge Mound. Please join me there when you're ready. Wait, this fast? She does have more experience reading it, but still. Also, that's not what that says. <laughs> Oh well. So where do you want me to go? That's quite a walk. Don't know if I can go up 
Don't know if I've got to go round. Kind of looks more round than up, to be perfectly fair. There's some lost things for other people. Poor people. Losing their satchels. Yeah. Oh, what? I missed! <laughs> Sammy, turn around. Go ahead. Terrible throws. I can't go this way. Not good. Excuse me. <laughs> Coming through. So I definitely can't go that way. I'm trying to life drain me now. See, I knew I'd read it recently. But I couldn't really remember what it was. Why does that look out of place? Oh, Tangler. Tangloof even. It is level 45, unobtained. I definitely can't catch it with a Pokeball. But I want to! I will leave you for now. But I will pick up that because that's worth a Great Ball. It's so weird to think that one Iron Chunk equals one Great Ball. The economy's changed around this kind of stuff. I wasn't wrong. There's a Pokemon in the water. Can I catch it? No. What? What? Space-time distortion? Where? So mean. <laughs> oh, over there. I miss. <laughs> Oops. Call our first crow gun. I'm gonna go the wrong way at this point. Oh. Hello. Bad timing. I was after you. So hopefully, maybe a light ember will not take you out, but I'm pretty sure it will. 
Ooh. Your evolution's done pretty good for me, then. Well, Lava's uh, not enjoying taking that hit, though. And Roselia gets to go first no matter what. A bit more from the physical. Roselli was the one I was after, considering the fact that it's actually a request for us to start building up its entries. No luck. You can't be enraged! <laughs> Stop that! Bad. Get caught. Thank you. We'll have to get a buddy too. But Roselia was the true target there. <laughs> Very much Lee. A move was mastered by Quilava then. I switched to Bibarel. Big Bibarel! It's a graveler! It's a very start of the <laughs> Do you want to go? Yeah, I roll the way I would too. <laughs> oh, wait a second. That's four times effective, isn't it? Whoops. He didn't stand a chance. Oh, critical hit too. Fine, you turned it to 10 tumble stones. Turn around again. Right, we got the Badoo. Right, we got some more Bibarels over here. Bidoofs too. I'm glad it actually activated on the thing. Oh, there's a Wisp up there. Let's go. Wait, what's this? No, oh, that's... I'm sure the thing is... It's not intimidated at all, I'm sure. Actually, let's just run. I'm not here to fight you, Bibarel. I was wondering what this is. Oh, he really wants to go. I want up on that. And so, Oliz was sidetracked once again. Remembering that he's got to collect resources here, there, and everywhere. Hetcha berries. Space-time shenanigans going on over there, too. What? That was a critical hit. How can it not catch? Side tracking is good. Side tracking is the name of this game. Let's face it. That's what we're doing. <laughs> I'll just collect it while it's like lit. What was that stats about? <laughs> 19 wisps remain in that area. I have a feeling we're going to catch a lot of Ghastlies by the time we're through this place. You can gather that. I thought so. Just was super suspicious. So I get various... Health things. There's another sleeping carnivine over here. Several sleeping guys over here, actually.
Another space-time distortion appeared? You mean not that one? There's another, another one? That Cassie looks kind of big. Oh man, they should have had it to so those Gastlies if they do spot you a bit. They should not fully alert when they see you, and they should like disappear and then appear behind you. Scare the absolute crap out of you. Soon, probably have enough to get the full entry for Ghastly at this rate. See, they actually don't notice you very much at all if you're crouched. That also looks like a big Ghastly. Oops. Bye bye, final ball. I'm already scared of doors. A ghastly scaring you would probably finish me off. Yeah, you're probably right. To be fair. We don't need that. You're right. Oops. <laughs> and we're blocked off from going this way. I guess I better start going the correct path again. <laughs> I was say, why aren't you reacting a bit faster to me, though? Yeah, we're going to get overleveled very fast, but it's not really the battles, the, the thing of this game. So I don't really mind it. It's pretty much everything else. help myself. I know we've caught tons of Psyducks, but it's just right there. That's a tangle over there. He's new. So he's our target, or she. I don't think I'm going to be able to sneak up on this guy in time. So I went with a longer range ball. I was thinking that would be a bit too much from the side. Shh, you saw nothing. Okay, you're angry now. I get you. You're gonna have to be, though. Quilava deals with all the issues. <laughs> Thinking you live. Gast. Can I do a agile quick attack and not finish him? Or is that a little bit too much damage? Ooh. I think I'll throw a great ball just to make sure it's caught. 
Because I don't want Quilava to get knocked out. Perfect HP. Another one added to our survey. Who can see me and who is attacking me? Oh, there's two. That's why. I didn't know there was another one there. I think the space-time distortion has gone away. Oh, we get bogged down in the mud, we do. Alright, Geodudes. Croaky Benz. <laughs> May as well give it a throw, it's facing the wrong way. Something seriously started happening behind me then. Dive, don't go in the mud. Bog. <laughs> so it does tend to lock on. What's that? Oh, it's just wood. <laughs> Can I break that? I just got hit, Quilava. Life is bad. What that? Foot, foot, foot. Is that? Yes, it is. Uh, Hippopotus. Like, there's an alpha. An alpha over there. We actually have to do something involving these, but I can't remember what it is. that dude off to? Well, these guys are supposedly seeing me or being made to be aware of things going on. They don't seem to squidge. Be too aware of me crouching. That's for certain. Just a standard Geo dude. No gravel this time. Alright, we'll run from the Geodude, because he'll go away. Do we, oh, do we not get the resources if we don't get the Geodude? Oh, I didn't know that. I said, what level's this dude? Not everyone's a dude. Not Geo or not. 46. Let's continue sneaking them. It's like ever so slightly short. Come on. Shh. Don't look this way. Don't look this way. No, 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 no. No, we don't need those teeth. Hippos are scary. Oh, come on. That was like... Sh centimeters. As a request here. Yeah. 
Hello there, so you're the survey corps child who quelled the Lord of the Woods, are you? You could help with setting up our new base camp, and we're making one up by the box. Our Odo could sure use someone that's capable as you. He's a fresh construction corps recruit, still learning the ropes. I probably should do this if this gets me a camp more than do the main thing. You know what I mean, right? Camp's pretty good. Music coming in, there's a band up above us. As man with his subs up. Thank you very much. I'm saying up this way, are you? It looks like you're in trouble. What a stench indeed. Oh, there. I'd keep your distance if I were you. Just look at those bobbers. They're taking up the spot where I was going to set up a base camp. Is there a demon in your backpack? One stunky would be a headache, but this little group is a full-blown migraine. Maybe I can get someone else from the team to handle this. Someone good at battling. Hey, I'm not bad. Are you sure you're up to this, though? They stink something fierce. Leave it to me. Do I have to take them on all at the same time? Well, if you insist. Well, you're going to have to beat three of them, so... But you've got to beat three of them, so be ready to run and stay downwind. <laughs> Three on one. Ugh. I have a feeling my Espion's about to be horribly ganged up upon. <laughs> Some of them are just looking around. Did my move just not happen then? Did it miss? Oh shoot! Never mind. Yeah, I'm a moron. Sudden memory. Okay, the last trouble. I wonder, should we just get Quilava out to try and wreck them fast, or go with Salavia who has some other options like Roost? How dare they be dark typing too? It's an alpha! Let's move to a more dramatic position. The butts of our enemies. Oh, okay. Seemed a bit mean there. Can I select, select me? Send out free Pokemon. <laughs> if they're doing it, you can do it too. <laughs> okay, that one was burned. That one's looking around. That one's finished off Quilava annoyingly. Irritating foes. Can I switch target as well? Ah, ZL. Because the other one's burned, so it should die in time now. I love how that doesn't even change anything. Kind of irritating overall.
Wait, double hit is a stance now? I don't even know what I'm doing. Right, the other one will get knocked out in the future anyway. Maybe I boosted my attack. Oh, I'm going to have to look up some of these moves. Oh, you got him. Or Cyber. Well, it's free for free. You weren't kidding. You've got talent. And your Pokemon was so brave too. I can't believe you handled free stun gear by yourself. I'm getting smelly. Thanks to you, we can now get the base camp set up now. Hold on a minute. There we go. What do you think? Makes things feel a little safer out here, no? There's not a whiff of stunk here either. Stop by any time. A new base camp set up. I didn't even think of catching them. It wasn't important to me. This makes a second base camp for us to use in the Crimson Islands. Perhaps some stunky will pop by for fun and games sometime, eh? Wouldn't that be a treat? No. No. <laughs> We're kidding. Yep, I have talent. And now I need to rest because my poor Pokemon got beaten up. Poor, poor guys. Maybe there's some nearby Stunky, to be honest. Right, a new camp is ours. Hey, how many more of these could I make? 25. Need more Apricorns is basically our limiter at this point. Maybe I should make some Stealth Spray. What now on that last for? Smoke bomb? Maybe I should like, be using like these weird things. <laughs> That's kind of fun. But then we remembered about our space. Our space! <laughs> yeah, that's a bit of an issue. Okay, camp defeated. To be honest, Losing a bit of the experience isn't terrible for us. We've got loads as it is. 